coolies, I saw. I was scared I wouldn't pick the right one. <laughs> Luckily, I did. It was the most refreshing one of them all. Sun Country wine beer. You see, Sun Country is a blend of premium white wine and real cool cheese. Hello? Hello? Who is this? Oh, I don't think we know each other. Hey there. Yeah, I, I called a few seconds ago. Well, you hung up before I could say sorry. Well, sorry for accidentally calling you. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. D don't hang up. I want to talk to you for a second. Hey. Why don't you want to talk to me? What's your name? You tell me yours, I'll tell you mine. Okay, no names. I get that. But why can't we chat? You sound nice. Busy. <laughs> well, uh, what are you doing that's got you so occupied? Do you have company? No? That's a shame. Do you have a boyfriend? Oh. <laughs> no reason, just curious, I guess. Say, you never did tell me your name. Oh, well, you know. I want to know who I'm looking at. I said I want to know who I'm talking to. Why? What did you hear? You have to go. But I thought you said you were all alone. Why do you hang up on me? You're hurting my feelings. Am I making you nervous? <laughs> wow. You're holding that kitchen knife all fully tied to your chest. Think you know how to use that thing? You got a real nice house, you know. What do I want? I don't want anything. Now you can be reasonable. No. Why don't you move to that kitchen window and look outside? Do it. Let me turn on the lights for you. See that out there? Your bratty friend didn't follow orders like you. Look at him now. Hang in there. Don't be scared. Cause you listened, I'm gonna give you a head start. Okay. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. And here I thought there'd be more of a chase. Honestly, the others did much better than you. What? Are you feeling all right there? It looks like you had a nasty fall. <laughs> you know, there was something about you. Something about the arrogance. Even after all the local papers and even the international reports came in of the brutal murders, you 
Well, you decided that you were special. That no one would come for you. That the harvester wasn't interested in you. It's adorable. You are not. No, 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 no. We're just getting started. You would have thought, after your friends were picked off, you would have realized this is all about you. It's always been about you. What's the matter? Feeling nervous? Is the mask... Intimidating. <laughs> How about I pull it down? <sighs> Hello, darling. <laughs> well, I guess this is a surprise, right? Didn't expect to see little old me. You like the voice? I really, really tried hard with the voice. <laughs> well, I told you I was taking those acting lessons, but... God, if you never listen to me... Never! In your godforsaken fucking life. No. This isn't a prank. This isn't a joke. It's me. Your loyal boyfriend. The one who you always put on the sidelines. <laughs> Your studies come first. College is hard. I never got those opportunities. And you wave it in my face. You know that? You're talking about Moving up to the big smoke. Getting away from here. <laughs> well, shit, if that didn't just drag me over the edge. I'm the harvester. And this has all been for you. All those true crime stories you read. All those unsold mysteries you watched. I remember sitting on the couch next to you. You VCR'd it. <laughs> well, now you got your own little unsolved mystery. Who would have guessed the spurned lover Killed every single one of the victim's friends systematically, and yet they still couldn't put it together. My God, the arrogance on you is unparalleled. I should just use this to gut you right now, spread you out. But damn it. That ain't how I feel, you know? That just ain't how I feel about all this. There's some sick part of me that still wants you in my life. I figured if I removed all the others, all those obstacles, then maybe... Maybe things could get better. I could see it, the writing on the wall. Wanted to move away. Talking to your friends more than you talk to me. You wanted to end it. You wanted to end it. And they were spurring you on. No. That ain't how this is gonna go. It ends when I say it ends. And it ain't ending. So... 
Until the time being, I'm gonna drag you back. Back to my barn. You know the one I got in the family stead, the one I told you you're not supposed to go into? Yeah, that one. Well, I figured it would be a big reward for you. Finally got that uh, curiosity of yours satiated. Yeah. You always thought I was stupid. I could see it in your eyes. Always thought I was lesser than you, like you were doing me a fucking favor by dating me. Well, who's smart now? You didn't figure out shit. And it was right in front of you the whole time. Where's your big Ivy League college now? Despite everything, you know. Despite everything. I thought maybe, maybe I was wrong, but they told me, you know, when I went to Justin's place, held a sickle against his throat, I took off my mask and showed him, and he laughed. He told me how much you wanted to end it. But that you were too scared to hurt my feelings. Is that right? Well, now... Now things are different. One way or another. One way or another. You're gonna be with me. I could, uh, keep you in the barn. We have a happy life. You know, with some alterations to our, uh, situation. No more being talked down to. No more country boys, city slicker nonsense. Or you go on my mantelpiece next to the other bucks. In truth, I don't care at this point. You dragged me to this, and you're the one who's gonna end it. You got that, sweetheart? Good, good. I wonder. Do you ever think your life was gonna end up like this? I sure didn't know. I used to love horror movies when I was a kid. I tell you, my pa, he used to take me down to the local theater. And, uh, man, if they were in a hoot. And you get that rush, you know? Being the killer. Being the... brought to life. So I should thank you, darling. Thank you for showing me the real me. So what's it gonna be? Am I gonna have to 
end our relationship? Or do you reckon you could be a bit more agreeable? Good. Remember, anytime I feel like I can't rescind this offer, and I might. So, best behavior. Mind your P's and Q's. Good. Let's get back there now. And darling, just remember, I love you. Artwork in this video was by Mermaid. Thank you.